Hey, what's going on guys? It's Omniarch and today we're going to be talking about uh, Google Plus and how that's not really going to be a thing anymore. Um, I know the other day uh, someone at Google was mentioning how they're no longer going to force users to have their YouTube channel integrated with Google Plus and you'll no longer need a Google Plus account in order to comment on videos and basically to have a YouTube channel. I mean back I think like two or three years ago um, when Google Plus first came out and was first launched after a while they decided okay we'll take our most popular platform which was YouTube and if people want to use YouTube, they're going to need a Google Plus account and we're going to integrate them. And that way, uh, they'll automatically have a huge uh, user base of Google Plus, basically, so they can, you know, I don't know, tell their investors like, hey, look what we did. We made Google Plus and it's an instant success because look how many people already signed up. But the reality is no one was using Google Plus. They were just signing up because they were forced to. And, uh, you know, it, it, it was a shit show. Um, it was confusing. And, you know, it's, I mean, I haven't really noticed it anymore. Like, I've ignored it completely. And every time I upload a video, it goes to my Google Plus page. Uh, but that doesn't really mean anything. I mean, I don't use Google Plus. I don't post there. I don't really follow people or add people to my circles I mean uh, you know it just it was a failed project and uh, you know YouTube or Google tried to uh, I guess make people use it and you know they fit I guess what they thought was okay we'll make people use it you know we'll make people have to sign up in order to continue to use YouTube and then once they sign up they'll see how good it is and then they'll keep using it just because it's good that's probably what they were thinking uh, but unfortunately that's not the case and you know this is a big lesson I think for corporations and big business uh, that you can't force people to use or consume your product especially when there's a better alternative uh, and you know you can't really blackmail them I guess or hold them hostage and say hey if you want to use our product you need to also use this one too you know uh, people would rather use Facebook uh, they'd rather use Twitter they'd rather use Instagram and there's really no room for Google Plus in that space you know because there's already like a monopoly I guess on social media and there's you know the big the big three social media networks are Facebook Twitter Instagram and they all have their own uh, purposes they they serve their own uh, demographic and they have a niche in the social media world where people would say okay if I have a short idea or something and I want to connect with or, or if I have something to say about a trending topic or something I'll put it on Twitter if I if I happen to see a really cool sunset or uh, whatever or I'm I look really good today I'll post it on Instagram and if I'm trying to connect with family or get people together for events and stuff I'll go on Facebook there's no room for Google Plus in any of them because it's not better than any of them you know it's not a better alternative uh, they basically just it was their spin on Facebook and it wasn't better so no one is going to take the time to make their profile all over again add all their friends and hope that their friends are going to do the same it's just it's it's unreasonable to assume that everyone that you know that you're friends with on Facebook is going to a want Google Plus B make a whole new profile on a whole new social network uh, and, and C try and get their friends to do it and also learn how it works because Google Plus was not user friendly I mean I did, the circle thing was kind of confusing you know some people you were following and other people you were friends with and other people were in a certain group that if you could make a group and you know it, it was weird and I, I just I didn't like it I didn't like Google Plus uh, I still don't like it and I'm really glad that it's no longer attached to uh, the YouTube channels or it's soon to be I don't know when this is gonna start uh, but I'm glad that we won't have to use Google Plus anymore um, I don't know if there's gonna be a way to unlink them or if it's just for new people signing up like when you sign up you don't need to make a Google Plus account so I don't know how that's gonna work uh, so Google Plus okay. rest in peace I guess uh, not really cuz I don't really care for you um, it's not gonna be missed I, I don't think by anybody really uh, and it's not I don't know it's gonna go away and I'm gonna forget about it so soon because uh, I never used it like I said I never used Google Plus I only had the account because I had a YouTube account and now that is not required so um, I'm not gonna notice it's gone really 
uh, good riddance, I guess. It makes it a little bit easier for other people trying to use YouTube. They don't have to, okay, let's make a Google Plus account, and then I want a YouTube channel, but I want a YouTube username instead of my real name, so I have to make an additional account on my Google Plus account, and then only use that for YouTube. It was just stupid. It was a fucking mess, and I'm glad it's gone. And, um, yeah, so that that's, a, that's a, I guess, a big lesson to Google. No matter how much money you have, you can't force consumers to use your products. And uh, I think in the next two years or so, we're gonna we're gonna see Google Plus just kind of fade away into non-existence because uh, there's gonna be no one left now that YouTube isn't attached. They're ba that's basically them just waving the white flag, like, okay, we're gonna stop pumping resources into Google Plus because no one's using it. It's not really growing, uh, you know, and that's that. So. Yeah, I mean, if you guys liked Google+, Plus, if anyone liked it, then uh, I guess this kind of sucks for you, because there's definitely, there's no way that it's going to stay around. There's no one, there's not even like a, a core group of people who are like, oh yeah, Google+, Plus is way better than, you know, Facebook. It, there's just, it's going to go away now. Um, it was basically just a an ugly eyesore attachment to YouTube, and it's going to go away. Um, I think Google has a different platform. I think it's called Google Photos or something like that, and I don't know if it's going to be like Instagram or if it's going to be like a Google Drive for pictures, or I don't know what it's going to be, but I know that some of the members of the Google Plus team have moved over to that team, so they're going to be, I guess, developing and expanding that, and I guess that's going to be a new project from Google, and we'll see how that goes. But anyway, see you later, Google Plus. If you enjoyed the video and if you hate google plus click that like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one and comment down below telling me what you think of google plus and that's about it guys so thanks for watching omni arc out peace